So we are busy trying to shift focus in our modeling efforts to start to address the question not of when the peak for hospital demand will be, because many states are at the peak or about to enter the peak, but rather to try to understand when the residual burden of infection in the community may be low enough that the, it is safe to consider relaxing some aspects of social distancing. That shift requires us to make sure that we understand the dynamics of uh, the epidemic on the downswing. Uh, and what we're observing in some states, New York, for example, some countries, some regions in Europe as well, that uh, places are spending quite a protracted period at the peak and then coming down off the peak. So that's one part of what we're trying to capture in the modeling. And we're also trying to set up the modeling framework so that we can take into account the ramped up testing capacity uh, and contact tracing capacity that some places are trying to put in place. So it's the combination of those factors that will determine when a shift to a containment strategy could be reasonable or minimize the risk of a resurgence.